This coffee shop has an area of only six square meters, but it still gets its fair share of attention. Every morning, the coffee shop helps dozens of local residents wake up. Oleg and Ina Yarovi have dreamed of their own coffee house for many years, but they decided to carry out their plans only in the fall of 2015, when they moved from Kiev to Warsaw. Three months later, they opened mini espresso bar Dobro, near the Ukrainian embassy. Since then, this tiny coffee house has built up a base of dozens of regular visitors and a certificate from the local Book of Records. We found the Book of Records in Poland. We looked up the smallest coffee house in the country, and we saw that in 2011, the coffee house in Lodz was measured to be 14 square meters. We have only six square meters, and the difference is significant. We wrote to the Book of Records and they arrived, measured everything, and gave us our certificate. Thus, we officially became the smallest coffee house in the country. Oleg admits that the cafe culture in Warsaw is fundamentally different from the Ukrainian one. After 4 p.m., the Poles practically stop drinking coffee, and most cafes have only the basics espressos, americanos, and lattes. The Yarovis decided to play with those basic options in their coffee house. They offer drinks with oranges, pumpkins, chestnuts, and even more inventive flavors. My favorite is coffee, which is called Sunny Coffee. And it's very sweet. It's with honey. It's with uh, hauva, which is something oriental for Poland, but it's, it's very good. And this is the only place where I can get such coffee, so I came here every time I, I am nearby. Uh, and yes, I enjoy it very much. Both Polish and Ukrainian can be heard in the coffee house. That's because many Ukrainians are among Oleg and Ina's clients. The Dobro coffee house has turned into a pilgrimage site for the local Ukrainian diaspora. People come here not only to drink coffee, they come to talk to me or to someone they know. During this time, we've acquired a lot of regular customers, about whom we know literally everything. And they often come to us because in a large network of coffee shops, ours is unique. Often, the coffee house holds charity events. They have successfully implemented the pending coffee system, where a cup of coffee is paid for in advance as an anonymous act of charity. So if you're having a bad day, you can always expect a nice, warm and invigorating drink to help get things straight.